generation is very smart they have a lot of exposure and uh, then they are independent they have their you know dreams which they have to you know put in and uh, how you feel then they have they are they are okay with open relationships and they are okay with live in but why do you think that commitment in a relationship or marriage is very very important we just discussed that they come out they are coming from fear a lot of fear is there they are scared to get into a relationship right now the only way to move forward in your relationship is commitment if i don't have commitment towards let's say anything actually if there is without commitment there is no depth into anything puja whether be it your work be it your relationships or uh, any other sphere of your life so commitment is the crux crux of moving forward in any area of your life so uh, uh, happening happening so uh, knowing each other happening but commitment becomes a taboo still because of the simple reason that they are not sure what they are getting into will it remain the same and what i'm getting into is it going to be um, is is it true what i'm getting into the picture that i'm being shown by uh, my partner is that the true uh, sense of that partner or not you know that fear is also there and the biggest thing is that puja all these children who are millennials um, they are working they are earning well they are smart they have seen the world on a click of a button uh so there's lot of insecurity as in how do i come out so out of this comfort zone you were just now right. mentioning that we as parents we are providing almost every comfort to our child and of course they're smart enough to create one for themselves having another individual into your life who's going to so to say share your room share your life is pretty challenging for children today to come out of their comfort zones mm-hmm. right so then that's where the commitment phobia comes that if i'm committed you know i will have to change my life i will have to come out of my comfort zone and they are not prepared for it yeah. so live in so relationship chalta hai open ended relationship chalta hai real privacy is a big you know uh, issue these days with the kids because they want their own privacy from very young age i think so that is a major uh, you know aspect you just shared on, that yeah and it's on level of not sharing your code of the phone number not sharing right. your passwords the privacy is on that level it's not even only privacy of the space so you know or in your life or on your activities and hobbies it's in that micro level so you can imagine how challenging it is for children today to let go of that privacy come out and open and be receptive and accept accept as somebody else to come into their life and bring in their own bit that's where things go wrong and that's why they are opting for live in relationships open ended they can if, if it works out we might get married otherwise this is a happy situation so so the fact of the matter is sweet had uh, just wanted to add that yeah. they are never happy even dating and living together it doesn't surprise them it doesn't